Hey, what's up everybody? Mr. Pop Forever, back in the building. So, I started taking this one apart. This other pooch maxi project. But I said, let me get a video before I get carried away. And you guys, you know, can't see the magic happen. So I started taking it apart and then I slowed down a little bit. And I said, you know what? Let me get a little small video. Like I said, I'm sorry. So, I get them like this, you know, beat up, a little rusty. And, you know, I find them like this, man. A couple hundred dollars here and there. And by the way, if anybody got any pooch maxis for sale, under 250 bucks is in my area, call me up. I'll take it. So, getting back to this. They start like this. And then when I'm done, doing my magic, boom. You know, I take it as a piece of art. You know, I do my own custom colors. I get carried away sometimes. Sometimes I just do something simple. But you know, I get real in depth in the details. Got that orange ring around the Speedo cluster. Got all the nuts painted black, accents. These racks are usually in terrible shape. I just scuff them up a little bit, black them out. The wheels, when they're good, they're good. When they're bad, they're bad. They get paint. You know, they get paint when they're bad, and when they're good, they stay chrome, which is rarely, uh, you know, rarely happens. So, be prepared, guys. I'm going to take some um, some comments on this. So, what color, you guys, you think I should paint this one? It used to be burgundy, which I really don't care no more. It's all beat up, like I said. It's rusty. It's beat up. Uh, I got the tank soaking with some cleaner to clean the tank out. I forgot to mention that, the tanks are usually all rusty. So I use this stuff here, the vapor rust. Put that in the tank, let it sit for like a week. Then I take it apart, blow it out, and start painting. And like I said, guys, you see the wheels? You know, when they're good, they're good. Like I said, when they're bad, they're bad. This is bad. Fork legs, bad. But like I said, I take care of all that. I got the headlight, got the wiring. Horn, bad. Headlight bucket, bad. Very bad. So we take that headlight bucket, and now check this out. This headlight bucket used to look just like that. Bad. Now how it looks, it looks pretty good. We painted the, the, the trim to match the rest of the army camo look. We got the new black in the back, nice. All the wiring is put back together. And I clean it all down to the wires, guys. I clean all the wiring out, I clean everything out. And usually, like I said, when I get them back together, it's what they look like. Check the seat out. Nice seat. Seat looks good now, right? Hold on, guys. Let me show you what the seat used to look like. The seat used to be like this, guys. Bad. Very bad. So I'm not gonna shout out no uh no company I get my products from because these guys don't support me on my bills. So I got a place I get a seat cover from, and I just reupholster the seat. But stay tuned, all right, guys? Stay tuned, stay tuned, stay tuned. This is gonna be uh, a nice project. Your boy, Mr. Pop Forever.